Unit 2 Feedback및 오류 수정 1. Feedback Sorry, what did you say the answer was? Because it hurt too much? That's not the right answer. Can anyone else answer it? Because the bill was too high? Good try, but not quite right. Think about it a little more. 답을 맞췄을 때 Bingo! Right! You are right! Correct! That's correct! That's the right answer! That was the exact answer! That's it! Exactly! Exactly right! Precisely! Perfect answer! You are absolutely right! You've got everything right! Now you figured it out. You've understood it well. It's a fabulous answer. Perfect. Not a single word is wrong. 답이 틀렸을 때 You're wrong. That's incorrect. That's not the right answer. You picked the wrong answer. Sorry, but you're incorrect. Good try, but not quite right. Nice guess, but it's not the right answer. Interesting idea, but it's not quite right. Why don't you think differently? You're very close. That was so close. That's almost right. You're nearly there. Partly correct. It's similar to that. Try again. Give it another try. Will you try it again? Think about it a little more. It's not the answer I want. That's not what I wanted. You have made a small mistake. Kita feedback. Do it over. Do it again. Do it better. Try harder. Practice harder. Do your best. Is this your best? You know this is not your best. I know you haven't tried hard. You could do better than this. Please do better next time. Try to do better next time. You should study harder. I would like you to write more clearly. I'm disappointed in you. This is full of errors. I can't accept this. Frankly, this is awful. This is not what I expected. There are too many mistakes. Honestly, I'm worried about you. I can't give you a score for this. Sorry, but you don't deserve a decent grade. Can't you, or don't you want to do it? Don't you know that you shouldn't do it like this? That's why I told you to listen carefully. Don't rush. Please show me some decency. You should be ashamed. Don't waste my time. 2. 오류 수정 Everyone, let's have a look at what Yunho wrote. Is everything right? Yes! No, there's an error. Can you see it? The spelling. That's right. The second word is incorrect. There's a P missing. It should be stopped. 교사가 직접 수정하기 Let's have a look at what you have got wrong. There's an error here. Your answer to number one is wrong. You have the wrong verb. You need a verb, but this is a noun. You should use past tense here. You should start with a capital letter here. The second word is incorrect. The spelling is wrong. You have spelt this word wrong. There's an M missing. You should change run to ran. You should change the Y into an I and add ES. No, it's an F, not a V. Wipe out the last letter. Wipe it out and write it again. Let me correct your mistake. 
Here, this is the correct sentence. 학생 스스로 오류를 찾도록 하기. Is this sentence right? Do you think the answer is right? Is there anything to correct here? Can you find the error? Who can pick the error? You can find it yourself. Where has it gone wrong? Try to think where it's wrong. What's wrong here? Think hard. Don't you think something strange? I see something strange. You're missing something. Can you see something missing here? You have forgotten something. There's one place you have to correct. Look at the sentence on the board, and you'll know where you've gone wrong. Go over it again and underline the part that you think is wrong. 학생 스스로 오류를 수정하게 하기 Give it another try. Could you try again? Think again. Now can you correct it? Find the error and correct it. Go ahead and correct the error. Now correct your errors yourself. You can correct it yourself. Try to correct it and I'll help you. I'll give you a hint. Please rewrite the sentence without the error. Do you think it's a s sound or a z sound? 친구들끼리 오류를 수정하게 하기. Exchange your test papers with the person sitting next to you. Check each other's answer sheets. Correct the errors if you see any. Tell your partners where there is an error. Please learn it from your partner. Please teach your neighbor. Correct the sentences with your neighbors. You may discuss with your group members. You'll be able to see other people's mistakes better. Don't just tell your partner the answer. Tell her how to do it. Who would like to help Dongyil? Who would like to correct Dongyil's sentence? Please explain Jihun why her answer is wrong. Today, Jihun will become the teacher and teach you. Sometimes your friends can be great teachers for you. Sam. 학생들의 태도에 대한 평가 Could you tell me how my girl's doing at school? Soyoung is doing just fine. She's a very bright student. At the same time, she is warm-hearted and knows how to respect her elders. Really? I was slightly worried because she's the only child in the family and she's kind of selfish at home. You don't have to worry at all. She's very polite to others. 긍정적인 평가 You are good at everything. You are outstanding. You are a gentleman. You are very wise. You are very brave. You are really enthusiastic. You are really popular among your friends. He is a very bright student. He is very cooperative. She is a very responsible person. She is a warm-hearted person. He always tries his best. He is a kind person. He is a very polite person. He knows how to respect elderly people. She has strong leadership. He is such a caring person. She is a very self-directed person. He is a good example to others. She is a sociable student. He is a creative student. He is a very generous person. He is a cheerful student. She is always optimistic. He knows how to think positively. 부정적인 평가 You are too selfish. You are so cold. You are a coward. You are a liar. That is impolite. Think before you act. He is a cold-hearted person. He is irresponsible. She gets easily distracted. He is a bit violent. He is so mean. He has no manners. She is not a polite person. She has bad behavior. 
He is a dishonest person. She has bad habits. He speaks ill of others. She is a bit pessimistic. He is a bit too sarcastic. He uses bad language. He doesn't consider other people. She does not get along well with others. He takes everything so personally. He keeps annoying other students. He doesn't know how to respect teachers.